folks and welcome you back to global education zone in this video i'm going to be teaching you guys how to describe any number of equal circles about a given circle each circle to touch two other circles and also the given circles so in this case we have, we have to describe four equal circles about a given circle so now the first thing is to draw the given circle so i'll draw the given circle let's let have the given circle so This is our given circle here. Yeah. So the next stage is to divide the circle into its equal parts and produce the lines. So in this case, we are we are touching because we are we are drawing four equal circles to touch the given circle or to touch other circles. So I'm going to be drawing um its its. So if you are drawing five, you you draw you divide the circle into ten parts. But since we are drawing four equal circles, you just need to divide into eight parts. And you can make use, you can you can do this making use of your set square. So we will make it up before 5 degrees set square. Let's do that. So have this line. We'll draw the um horizontal diagonals too. So, so, so. so this will be the vertical diagonal. So the next stage is to um is to is to Divide into eight parts. I will make this up for five degrees set square. It's the best thing to use to divide it circle into eight parts. So that's the best way. Making it up for five degrees set square. So I also go to the other side and cut. So I won't I won't do the procedure downwards. I'll just extend the line downwards. So you don't need to repeat that downwards, just extend them downwards. Then extend this one too. Downwards. Extend this downwards too. So then we have that. Then the next stage is um, we we'll divide it into eight parts, and we are going to uh, produce the lines outwards. So I'm going to extend this, these, um, these lines that I used to divide the circle into eight parts. So extending it, extending them. This one too. I'll be extending this one too. Now good. Now we have that. Now the next thing to do is to construct a tangent at A. This is point A here at the bottom, at the very bottom of the circle. Let's construct the tangent at A. I will bisect the angle ABC to intersect the diameter produced at one. So all you need to do is don't need to stretch yourself too much. So you know that since this is the bottom of the circle, any tangent passing through this will be horizontal. Let's just let us project this horizontal line. So, and then to pass through this A. So this is this will be the tangent at A. So now the next step is to do is is you bisect this angle A B. Let this let this be. Then let's bisect let this be C. This is probably C. So bisect um A B C. So when we bisect A B C, we'll get a point. So let's bisect A B C. So A B C. So extend your line and then cut the bisector. Left, cut it, right. Then now you draw a line through this bisector to the to the intersections. So just do that. So this is the bisector. And then this bisector it 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 it, it touches this vertical diagonal at point. Let's call this one. So the next step to do is we center O and we just O1. Mark the remaining three centers. Two, three, and four. So we center O. This is center O. And we just O1. So you will mark the remaining three centers. So these centers you are marking they will be the centers of your circles. Let's mark it O1. Let's mark the second center. O2. So this four. O3. And O4. So this one, two, three, four, they will be the centers of the circles. Two, three, and four, and then these circles we can now draw the circles. So we'll say just a one, draw the circle. So I open to a one. That is one and a between them. So I'll, I'll draw the first circle now. So you can see this is the first circle. Just a one, draw the first circle. So then we also have the second circle, which we just um. A1. I also draw the second circle. Yeah, we have the second circle. 
So I can I will, I also adjust this um project so that the pass through the circle because it looks like I missed the center. Okay, there we go. So well, this is this is second circle. So this is this circle. You can see that this circle is obviously passing through the um, the initial circles. So this is the third this third circle. It's passing the it's crossing the initial circles and it's also touching the center circle. Then finally we have the last circle. See, it touches the other ones. So that's good. So this is how to draw. Okay, I can also complete the video set. So this is how to draw four circles or any number of equal circles about a given circle. Thanks for watching.